Men are usually swayed by good looks when they see a woman, and they decide if they are attracted towards a woman or not in the first few minutes of the initial meetings. Though this, later on, can change, they might initially feel infatuated towards her and later on think that she isn't worth it or gets distracted by someone else. A lot of how your relationship will be with a woman depends on how you treat her in her early days when you started talking to her. It is not that difficult to make a girl fall for you and we are making sure you are on top of your game. Men who never chase are the ones who ultimately get the girl. Also, women like it when men don't chase them and are not easy to get. Greetings, dear all seekers of wisdom. Welcome to the channel Virtue Vibes. Today we'll discuss the most sought after topic on how to make her chase you. Before going in further, I would request you to please subscribe, like and share our channel for life-changing content. Subscribing our channel will motivate us to work hard and work consistently. You may have met an interesting girl and you may be looking for tips and tricks on how you can make a girl chase you. You try to do all it takes to garner her attention and want her to revert with the same as well. Society puts the onus of taking the first step in a relationship on a man. Many people might feel that it is only a man's responsibility to chase a woman and not the other way around. We all have been conditioned to think this way. However, people are getting more broad-minded in recent years and are challenging age-old beliefs. By doing all things right to make yourself irresistible for her, you can make her pursue you, draw her attention toward you and chase you like there is no other man for her out there. If your heart knows that she is the one for you, follow the practical tips in the to make her chase you. So here are a few tips that'll help you in making her fall for you. So we devise 10 simple ways to make the lady swoon and follow us. One, make your first impression count. Be confident. Do not fumble. Have something to say. You can't risk killing your first date with her, or else that just might be your last one. There can be nothing worse than not having anything to say, and the other person feeling sleepy or blabbering alone. You don't want to do that. To avoid the storm inside your head gets even worse. Start talking. Ask questions and show some interest. By the end of it, make her curious wherein she wants to know more, and you know enough to row your boat further. To be a challenge. Instead of doing the hard work, create situations where she is do the chasing instead. Don't be the desperate, needy and always eager to please guy. Come across as a powerful guy who has a lot going on his life and wouldn't go after a woman. Instead, build the mystery factor and draw them towards you. Ask the right questions. You are doomed forever if your opening statement is, do you have a boyfriend? Women generally think of us with a one-track mind, and this is your chance to prove them wrong. Never get into silly questions or details. Instead, ask her what's her equation with pets, or what's her favourite genre of music, and maybe you can play her favourite song once she agrees. Three, don't linger. Too much of anything is bad, and trust us, women don't like men hovering around them all the time and babying them. Give them the chance to yearn for you. Stay close, but stay away. Let them come after you when you make yourself scarce. In other words, use absence to make her heart grow fonder. Maintain your allure for her to unravel and further stand out from other potential partners in her life. We're not saying start acting shady or be evasive and vague during your conversations. Instead, make yourself some sort of an enigma, someone who isn't easily figured out, to pique her curiosity and keep her wanting to know more. This will drive her to want to get to know you and hopefully pursue a romantic relationship with you. Or pay attention to small details. Buying her a bouquet of roses every day or dropping obvious compliments aren't going to earn you any brownie points. Women are suckers for details. Tell her how her dress reminded you of your favorite love story writer or drop her a text about how she's in your thoughts even when you are not around. She will definitely come back for more of those. Six, know where to draw the line. You like her, she likes you back. Next thing to do, you ask her out on a date. But don't keep doing it again and again. Give her the chance to miss you. If she asks you out for dinner one night, play around a bit. Tell her you are not sure. You might have to check. Of course, don't keep refusing her every time. 
else she might lose interest in you. Figure out the real way and you could be the real boss. 7. Get to know her better. In an interview, the balance strikes when both parties have doubts and both their doubts are clarified. Do not go on blurting out everything about yourself without asking her a single thing. Find out what her likes and dislikes are and whether she fits the bill too or not. It's crucial to do so as this gives women an assurance that you are equally interested to take matters forward. Add a pinch of humor to the questions and you are on the right path, my friend. Eight know the difference between cocky and funny. If you can make a woman laugh, she will be yours. And we don't doubt this fact one bit. But there's a huge difference between being funny and being cocky. Don't ever try to demean her, especially in front of others, by trying to prove how sarcastic you can be, or she will never be yours. Make her laugh with good humor, and that will keep her thinking more about you. Good humor can do wonders, whereas sarcasm can often kill the vibe. It's good to make yourself dependable to someone you know is fond of you, but there can be a saturation point. If you constantly hover around her, trying to help her at every opportunity, it can come off as clingy. Try to strike a perfect balance by being dependable but not clingy and dazzle her with your genuine care and attentiveness. To demonstrate this, show her that if she needs you, you're there for her, but for anything else, she needs to reach out to you. 9. Hold on to your cards. Transparency is good, but mystery is better, at least when it comes to wooing women. Don't be an open book. Build some suspense and create some mystery. These are foolproof ways of creating attraction, an attraction so strong that she can't resist chasing you. It's unnecessary to keep your emotions a secret from the woman you're fond of, but if you want to fascinate her and make her chase you, it becomes almost a requirement. Be a good friend to her, spend time with her, and help her out if she needs. But do not let her know you are interested in her romantically. Avoid obvious flirting and cheesy lines. If she learns you're obsessed with her, she will think you are always available and may not feel the need to chase or pursue you. 10. Simple ways to make women. Chase you is stop chasing. There are only a few ways that you can be different. Don't go chasing her like any other guy out there. Let her take the first step for a change. Use the above tips and make sure you are not the one standing outside her balcony every night like Romeo. It's time for some role reversal, bro. Let her see that you're a guy worth chasing. Show her you're the attractive, high-value man that all women want and you'll get her chasing you in no time. If something is scarce, it's valuable, because it's more difficult to obtain. If something is abundant, it's less valuable, because it's easy to obtain. This is one of the laws that govern the way that we all think. It's why we value gold, but not dirt. It's why the value of currency goes down, when the government prints more of it. It's also why an attractive woman wants you more when you stop chasing her. You come across as more valuable when you're less available. It will also help you to start believing that women like the one you're chasing are abundant. It sounds harsh, but she's not that unique or special. A guy who was successful with women in general would know that. If she's the only woman who pays you attention, she'll come across as scarce to you and that's why you want her so badly. So stop chasing her and let her chase you. As we conclude our exploration on how to make her chase you here on Virtue Vibes, Remember that the essence of any genuine connection lies in reciprocity, respect, and authenticity. Rather than fostering a dynamic of pursuit, let's focus on creating spaces for mutual understanding, shared growth, and a harmonious dance of hearts. True connection thrives when both individuals contribute to the beauty of the relationship. Let your authenticity shine, be attentive to her needs, and embark on a journey where the pursuit is a shared endeavor. In the pursuit of love, let virtue be your guide. May your connections be rooted in honesty, kindness, and a shared commitment to nurturing a bond that uplifts both partners. If you found value in our discussion, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Give us your feedback through comments. 
your engagement fuels the continued exploration of meaningful connections here on Virtue Vibes. Wishing you a journey filled with genuine connections, mutual respect, and the enduring warmth of authentic love. Until next time, may your hearts be open to the beauty of connection, and may you navigate the intricacies of love with grace and virtue.